There are three fundamental mistakes that I see project managers make who are not getting the results that they want. The first one is that project managers focus too much on tasks and events and processes over and above people, over and above understanding the psychology of people and building great relationships. The second mistake is that they focus on the urgent over and above the important. What does that mean? Well, it means that they are very preoccupied with firefighting and dealing with the urgent matters instead of being more proactive and building results for the longer term. That means doing the risk management, doing the proper planning, uh, kicking the project off properly, building relationships, uh, providing vision and direction to the team, etc. These are all proactive activities that lead to the long-term results of a project. The third mistake I see many project managers make is that they believe they have to know it all and do it all by themselves. Why is that a problem? Well, not only does it put a huge amount of pressure on the project manager's shoulder, it also puts them into this regime of command and control. I know it all, hence I default to telling my team what to do. And that mindset is not the best for empowering the team, it is not the best for building a winning team at all. At the most fundamental level, project managers need to start changing their mindset. They need to start considering themselves as a leader. When we change our mindset into one of leadership, the actions will follow. So what does that mean? How can we do that? And what is a leadership mindset? Well, first of all, a leadership mindset is one in which we consider the value creation of the project. Project managers need to ask themselves, what is the effect of this project on the company's strategic objectives? What will make each stakeholder say that this project was a success three or five or ten years from now? What would make myself invest my own money in this project is another fabulous question to ask. Inquiring about the value creation of the project means that the project manager can begin to appreciate the big why of the project. That will help them to make better decisions and to ensure that the project actually adds value. It is a known fact that most projects fail because there is not a strategic link between what we're delivering here and the company's long-term objectives. Secondly, a leadership mindset means that we begin to connect with people in a different way. It means that we begin to inquire about the psychological aspects. So we can ask questions like, what would make each person show up to work, even if they didn't get a salary for it? What makes each person tick? That question can help us understand the drivers and the motivators for each person. We can also ask about why someone may be resistant to change. What is it that they fear of losing? So asking questions is a big trait of a leader, rather than just telling people what to do. Great leaders ask lots of questions and beginning to do that will help change and instill that leadership mindset.